did you guys do? I told you to hire somebody. We just hired Scott in his room. I fucking told you to hire someone. Why the fuck did you shut the door without the knob in it? Scott, what are you gonna do for the rest of the week? I don't know. Do you have enough footage to edit in there until we can get somebody to get you out of there? I got my fucking computer. We have to hire someone. Yeah, so apparently Scott had the same idea as me putting on the mustache, but I had the idea in my head first, but he filmed it first, but I don't care. So I'm gonna go into cover with his mustache on and his glasses. Ask my roommates how they really feel about me. Ah, uh, hello. Uh, I'm looking for uh, Scott. I'm an interviewer of the uh, Studio City uh, paper on uh, the roommates. How did you get in my room? Did Jason let you in? Jason let me in. I was uh, just curious uh, how it was like living with your roommates. Jason's great. I don't really like Todd that much. Which one is that? The uh, one with the... Uh, Olive skin one. He's super funny. Eyebrows. He's not that funny. He writes really good materials. And, uh, he uh, forming a band. Oh, I didn't know he's forming a band. He doesn't even play any instruments. I heard he's learning. Not very fast. Every once in a while I hear a when he's in there playing with his piano. Yeah, anything positive about him? No. I tried. I tried to think of something positive. I can't. Nice boy. Hey, hey, that's mine. Give that back to me. I need that. Uh, what? I need. Why are you doing these fucking fake interviews? I need. You doing a fucking fake interview with me? Can you shut up? I need to interview Jason. Get back. Okay, sorry I was so mean about everything. What the fuck? Did I do okay? You told me I suck at instruments and you, and you said I don't have good writing skills. Yeah, because you told me. You said you wanted me to insult you. Like, pretend like I didn't know it was you and then insult you for the Fuck day. you, man. I'm glad I'm going away for 10 days. No, I'm gonna miss you. To get away from you. Okay, what's up? We're here with Todd the Bod. Does this angle make me look thick? You always look good, Does brother. this angle make me look thick? No, that's just your cock, Todd. <laughs> What do they call me? Cocky Toddy. The big cock Todd. This is a day of putting stuff together. Scott's got a new chair. Putting stuff together because our lives are falling apart. I'm so scared to do this. What if I can't get it back? And now Todd has going to put a lock on his door because he thinks that people are going to commit his room. Conspire against me. It's just really funny. Todd's I'm like, why are you putting a lock on here? What do you care? He's like, I just, I just don't want people in my room. I just, no, no, I just don't want people in here. Both of my screwdrivers just one? Just one. What the fuck's my other one? Where is it, Jason? Man, Scott's fast, Todd. He's fast as hell. You know what I mean? I'm a construction to... god. My dad's a general contractor. His name's George. You ever go to work with your dad? Oh, yeah. I did. You did? I've so never you... had a real job. I've always worked with my, my dad or my stepdad. Really? What's your stepdad do? He's a... He's a male dancer. <laughs> <laughs> he was a bar. So I was a bartender and a construction guy. Really? All right, I give up. I can't figure out what to do now. <laughs> <laughs> I, yeah, I can't, can't figure out how to get this knob off. And yeah, I think I'm done. Let's just go in the pool and... Say we never did this. Say we did it, but hire someone to do it. And then say we did it. And then say we did it after okay. we hire someone to do it. <laughs> uh, lock right there. Yeah, that was me and Todd. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys. We're not actually useless. We're both pretty handy guys. Scott and I doing my door. Doing your door? <laughs> Scott, and just remember, uh, just stay We're handy. We're handy. We're not actually useless. We can do things. That's it. That's all I wanted to say. I just wanted everyone to know that I'm not actually a useless piece of shit. It's too lazy to install my own door handle. Somebody else. So I just installed my door. I like you give a shit. I have a spare key. And I'm thinking about giving it to someone slightly special. Todd, I have a spare key for my door. Do you want to take my spare and I'll take yours? Do you want to trade spares? I have an idea. Your door. Okay. This is my spare key. Put it on backwards. No, I didn't. You did. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. What? <laughs> it's not supposed to be. <laughs> yeah, it is. No, it's not. <laughs> oh, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, baby. Hello, senor, monsieur, monsieur, Jason. Hey. My name is Claude. I'm from the paper. Oh, Todd's cousin, Claude. 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 Claude Van Damme. Claude. I'm interviewing uh, the roommates on roommates to see how they like living with each other. Sort of like a, a sociology experiment. See, si. I mean, we. See, si. we. Si. Oui. Yes, you. Well, you're fluent. You do we oui and see. Si. See. Si. Amazing. Espanol and uh, the French. Obviously, you're a well-traveled man. Um, I'm quite intimidated, I'll be honest with you. Yeah, I'm very cultured. Very cultured indeed. Well, listen, I, I have a lot to say about the roommates here. Our uh, eclectic group of people, uh, one's from Hermosa Beach and one's from the other side of Hermosa Beach. Oh. So, very different worlds. One likes to surf, the other likes to boogie board. One likes to cry, um, the other one likes to sob. One is uh, very depressed, and the other is a lot of self-doubt. You can see, uh, we, we, we come from different worlds. Uh, we. 
three different white guys. Uh, it's like every day is his last. No bueno. There's that Spanish. Spanish. <laughs> <laughs> you, there's no getting past you, Monsieur Jason. You are impressive. Or should I say, Senor? <laughs> well, thank you. I appreciate the, uh, the line of respect, but I must say, uh, haven't paid any of the bills around here, and I owe Scott $2,400. Wow. Yes, yes, yes. I mean, see. Si. Si. <laughs> <laughs> oui. The thing is, is the roommates, one of them is very paranoid. He put a deadbolt on his door the other day. <gasps> wow. Wow. He's right. Wow. Wow. Obviously, this guy, you know, has got some major issues because there's nothing to steal in there. He must have something oh, if he does. On, hold on, hold on. Yes. The mustache. What's wrong with my mustache? It's moving. Oh, oh, peace. Peace, Claude. Ciao. All right, guys, here we are doing Todd's outro once again for him because he doesn't know how to talk to his goddamn camera. Yeah, I'm just, hey guys, I know it's like my 69th vlog and I'm supposed to do something crazy for it, but I didn't. It's okay. Everything you do is crazy because you're crazy. Um, I'm leaving for New Zealand in five hours. I don't have a watch. I do, it's okay. It's 4.40. Just got to miss me. Gonna miss him big time. Rush, guys. I'm gonna be gone for 10 days. Thanks for being my friend. Thank you for being my friend. I'll see you guys in 10 days, I guess. Look out for um, cool, adventurous, quality content. Thanks for watching. Bye. Dirty laundry. It moves, you know, my mustache moves around. Wait a minute. You really clap. Senor that Jason. mustache is. Senor Jason, this interview is done. Thank you very much, Madam Zuel. Josh Hartnett?